hello guys welcome back to the channel so if you are facing this kind of error preparing automatic repair on your laptop or desktop in this video we are going to fix this issue so this kind of blue screen you will get you can see the error automatic repair so let's start and fix this error first click on this advanced option then click on troubleshoot then click on this advanced option now here you will get these kind of options so the first method you can try is click on this option startup repair so this option will help you to repair all your startup files so click on this option and this will take few minutes so as you can see the error has been fixed now my system is booting properly but if you are still getting the same issue or some kind of error move on to a next method now click on troubleshoot click on advanced option now the second method you can try is click on this command prompt option so we are going to manually repair all the windows corrupted files so the first command uh, you can try to repair your windows corrupted files will be sfc space slash scan now so this command will repair or replace all the windows corrupted files press enter and this process will take around three to five minutes so the verification process has been completed now type the next command chk dsk space slash f space c colon so this command will fix all the error in your hard drive press enter and this process will take around uh, 10 to 15 minutes process completed now cut this window and after that click on this option continue this will restart your system and fix the error uh, but if you are still getting the same issue uh, some kind of error move on to a next method click on troubleshoot then click on advanced option now here you will see the option of system restore so this uh, option will help you to restore your system to the back date uh, if you have any restore point in your system uh, click on this option so as you can see uh, click on next and this is a, a restore point i have you can see the date and time so if you have any restore point in your system you will get this kind of screen so you have to select the date the back date then click on next and this will restore your pc uh, to the back date and fix the error but if you don't have any restore point in your system or if you are still getting the same issue move on to a next method click on troubleshoot click on advanced option now uh, if you don't have any restore point uh, you can try this method as well uninstall updates click on it now select both the options one by one and this option will help you to uninstall the previous updates and this uh, will also able to help you to remove or fix all kind of error related with the updates so you can try these two options as well move on to a next method if you are still getting the same issue now click on command prompt again and now we are going to uh, enter few more commands to repair some windows uh, main files some windows boot files so the first command will be boot track boot rec space slash fix mbr press enter now type the next command boot sect sect space slash nt60 space sys press enter now type the next command boot rec space slash fix boot press enter now type the final command boot rec space slash rebuilt bcd press enter that's it process completed now cut this window and after that click on continue and this will restart your system and fix the error now move on to a next method you can try if you are still getting the same error or any kind of blue screen error click on troubleshoot again click on advanced option now the next method you can try is click on this option startup settings so this option will help you to open your system in safe mode 
so click on this option click on restart now press f5 function key uh, in your keyboard and this will help you to open your system in safe mode press f5 function key so this will open your system in safe mode and if you recently install any kind of software or any kind of game and after that you are getting this blue screen error in safe mode you can easily uninstall that application now my pc is in safe mode so as you can see safe mode is written in all the four corners now open control panel so right click on the windows icon then click on this run option now type control then click on ok so this will open the control panel now in the view by section change it to small icons now here click on this option program and features so in my system i have only these softwares so if you recently install any kind of software or any kind of game and after that you are getting this uh, blue screen error uninstall that uh, software uninstall that game and you can also arrange your software by date wise by clicking on this option okay so simply right click on the software then click on uninstall and this will help you to uninstall the application so uninstall the application and after that restart your system okay this will help you to remove and fix the blue screen error now move on to a next method if you are still getting the same error same kind of blue screen error now if you tried everything every kind of method every kind of solution but you are still getting the same error the final method you can try is reset your pc so click on this troubleshoot option and here you will get the option of reset this pc click on this option and in this method all your personal data in your system in your desktop all kind of personal files all kind of personal images all kind of uh, personal document files will remain safe so in this process there will be no data loss all your data in your system will remain safe so you have two options remove everything do not select this option go for the first one keep my files click on it then click on this option local reinstall now here you will get the details reset this pc uh, this will go back to the default mode keep personal files so your data will remain safe this will un uh, reinstall your operating system the only drawback in this system is the softwares you have in your system will remove this is the only drawback but your personal data will remain safe and this option will reset your pc and remove all kind of uh, errors and this will reset your pc completely and fix all kind of error without losing any data so click on this option reset and this will take around half an hour and this will reset your pc completely and this is the final method you can try to fix your uh, system completely so these are the methods you can try uh, this is all for the video thank you